Hello. This is the construction of Ohm's law to verify the relationship between voltage and current. According to Ohm's law, the voltage across the conductor is directly proportional to current so that the resistance of the conductor remains constant. So in this construction, I have used different items or the apparatus. So let me introduce you. This is DC power supply where you can have the DC voltage ranging from 2 volts to 12 volts. You can move, you can change from 2 to 4, 6, 8, etc. But I have set to 2 volts, which is preferable. Now, this is rheostat, which is also called variable resistor. And this variable resistor is used to vary the resistance, and accordingly, the current in the circuit changes. This is ammeter to measure the current. This is voltmeter to measure the voltage. And here I have taken milli voltmeter. And this is the main component resistor which is having 0.1 ohms you can see on the label on the resistor this is one way key which is used for safety purpose in the circuit now let me explain you how i have constructed this if you see the dc battery you have two terminals positive uh, red terminal and black terminal the red terminal is called positive terminal the black terminal is called negative terminal so from the negative terminal of the battery i have taken a wire and it's connected to one end of the rheostat and the other end of the rheostat is connected to negative terminal of the ammeter and the positive terminal of the ammeter is connected to one end of the resistor from the same end one more y is taken and is connected to negative terminal of the voltmeter then the positive terminal of the voltmeter is connected to other end of the resistor from the same end one more wire has taken and connected to one side of the key and the other side of the key is connected to positive terminal so that to make a closer circuit still it is not closed because i need to close the key and this is the key and when i close it the current passes in the circuit and you can do the experiment okay so i close the key now let me turn on the circuit you can see the movement of the terminal uh, in the voltmeter and the ammeter okay movement of the pointer sorry pointers in the voltmeter and the ammeter okay if you want to check the voltage and current relationship you need to move the bar on the rear start when you move the bar on the rear start the corresponding current changes there is a change in the voltmeter and you can see the movement of the pointers in the voltmeter so in this way you will have to take the readings for the for the voltage for the corresponding current and the condition is the caution is you need to take the readings as it is possible because Ohm's law is satisfied for the constant temperature. When the temperature increases, the V is not directly proportional to I. It doesn't obey the Ohm's law. Thank you.